Sunday morning, or you talked about it Saturday night. Uh, this particular uh, movement song comes from the hymn, Don't Let Nobody Turn You Around. Don't Let Nobody Turn You Around. And it was about uh, uh, keeping your face set toward Jesus. She believes that she needs to talk when I'm talking. I talk to her all the time. <laughs> it's dialogical, so that will happen. Uh, this uh, particular song, we're going to add a couple of verses because they were a part of the movement. One of those is uh, Chief Pritchard. Ain't going to let Chief Pritchard turn me around. The other one is Bull Connor. Ain't going to let Bull Connor. Now, when I said to the young people, we're going to add a couple of verses, they said, who is Chief Pritchard? Luckily, I was prepared for the answer to that question. <laughs> chief Pritchard was the chief of police in Albany, Georgia. And when Dr. King was planning to go to Albany, Georgia to work with some farm workers, Chief Pritchard studied the methods of Dr. King and the nonviolent movement. And uh, because he studied, he knew that what the tool that Dr. King was using was the media as a tool, and that he didn't want any bad media about his city and his police uh, campaign, his, his reign. And so he decided that he was going to use the tools of nonviolence also. And what he did was tell all of his police officers, when you read the articles, it says he told all his men because there were no women police officers back then, 52. Um, don't take out your bully clubs. Don't take out, don't beat up anybody. Uh, and then he, he called all of, uh, Albany is a little tiny town, and Chief Richard called all the jails around in the surrounding community and said, uh, I need space in your jails. We're going to arrest all these folks. We're not going to beat them up. We're not, we're not going to run fire hoses on them. We're going to arrest them. He arrested over 100,000 people and filled up all of the region's jails. The reason he did that is because his police officer said, where are we going to put the actual criminals from, you know, Albany if we fill up our jails? Um, Dr. King attributed uh, Albany as one of his greatest losses. Several years later, in um, Birmingham was Bull Connor. And Bull Connor uh, is infamous for being the chief of police who called out the dogs and the fire hoses on the children. When you see a picture from Albany, I'm sorry, from Birmingham, it is Bull Connor. And so the, the leader in every movement music, there is a leader, somebody who's calling out what you're going to sing. I can tell them more. Our leader this morning will be uh, Fuller. So y'all as a congregation will pay attention to Fuller. He will yell out which verse we're going to sing, and then that's the verse we sing. When we get to the extra ones, you want to sing them, great. If you don't want to sing them, you don't have to sing them. 
Uh, thanks for uh, that, that teaching moment. And uh, I'm ready when y'all are ready. You ready? Thank you. 